losing time, I'm fading fast I just wanna make it last Try to let go of the past I close my eyes, embrace the blast Sleepless nights and headaches stack Restlessness to hell and back What's my purpose, what do I grab? Hi, I'm the graveyard, Trevor Troy Welcome to Pierce Township's Pierce Cemetery Let's go take a walk around, pay our respects, shall we? Ah, fair I.K. and Ronald Picture of them. Uh, uh, I.K. was born May 3rd, 1942. She passed away on September 12th, 2011. And Ron, born October 17th, 1942, passed away April 6th, 2015. Both married February 27th, 1959. One for K and one for Ronald. And rest in peace to both. K and Ronald Fair. Uh, Paul and Dora Frank. Paul born April 3rd, 1911 to July 26th, 1979. And Dora, November 11th, 1916, April 28, 2000. And both married February 23rd, 1935. One thing on the back of it. Nope. No point. No. One for Dora. One for Paul. Rest in peace to both Dora and Paul Frank. Roxanne B. Crawford. October 5th, 1979 to December 30th, 2021. Gone yet, not forgotten. Although we are apart, your spirit lives with us forever in our hearts. The angel wings. Come back. Oh, poem. The loving memory of Roxanne Crawford, daughter, sister, mother, aunt, grandmother, friend to many, our angel. All right, rest in peace to Roxanne. Rest in peace. Gene and Homer Watkins. Gone home to be with Jesus, but not forgotten. Picture of them etching their headstone. This is Gene was born July 15, 1935. She passed away on March 9, 1993. Homer was born August 9th, 1929, passed away August 3rd, 2017. I don't know the year they were married. Alright, I got a gym for them. Got one for Gene and one for Homer. So rest in peace to both Gene and Homer Watkins. Rest in peace. Uh, this says Betsy, 12956 to 128, or no. 42956 to 12894. That's all it says. A regular headstone. Well, I'll put one on here anyway. For Betsy. The rest of peace to Betsy here. Rest in peace. Oh, this one's our little angel, Jordan Elizabeth, 1987. Ours for three days, God's forever. Elizabeth, it's a girl. I got a little gem with a little picture on it. I say rest in peace to the little our little angel Jordan. Rest in peace. Mother and a grandmother, Pearl J. Case, April 18, 1930 to December 8, 1996. Forever in our hearts. She can't think of where it is. Got her gem. The rest in peace, Pearl. Rest in peace. Thomas M. McCarthy, October 13th, 1953 to February 12th, 1997. I know you're not there somewhere. Somehow you can hear my heart. I know I'll find you somehow. And someday I'll return again to you. Back to this. Nope. Well, got a gem. I'll put it up here. So rest in peace to Thomas. Rest in peace. Ev Evangeline and William Beavers. Look at them, let's be them walking together. So our memories will do, they will get us through. Think about the days of me and you and know I'll always love you. Evangeline born May 10th, 1935. November 10th, 2007, she passed away. And William, April 24th, 1932. Passed away May 12th, 2007. That same year. Hang okay, on the back of the head song. Nope. 
Got one for his Angeline and William. The recipes to his Angeline and William Beavers. Home with Jesus, Roy and Margie Webb. The picture of them they were married or together. Roy was born April 1st, 1930, passed away April 17, 2017, and Marjorie April 12, 1929, to December 16, 2018. Both married June 11, 1949. One has both angels on the back. One for Roy and one for Margie. So rest in peace to both Roy and Margie Webb. Louise and George Sizemore. I guess when we got married. Uh, Louise born April 23, 1943 and passed away November 9, 2021. Her husband, September 19, 1934, he passed away February 28, 1990. Yeah, they do. Got their children's names. Diane, Judy, Tina, George, and Sherry. Oh, yeah, they were married April 25th, 1964. One for Louise and one for George. Rest in peace to both Louise and George Sizemore. Rest in peace. Dolores and Frank Scragg, as they say. It. Dolores, born 1929, passed away in 1990, and Frank, born 1925, passed away in 2004. Frank was a Lance Corporal in the U.S. Marine Corps. I'm Frank J. Scrag III. I'll put the flag back here. And I'll put a gem for both of them up here. This is for Dolores, and this is for Lance Corporal Frank Scrag. So rest in peace to both Dolores and Frank Scrag and Superfied Frank, Lance Corporal Scrag. Uh, beloved son and brother Nathan S. Gast. They were in 2nd, 1998 to November 13th, 1998. Pick room. Back. Uh, it says Gast. Let's put this beside the she shell. Mickey Mouse. Say so rest in peace to little Nathan. Rest in peace. Hey, you can tell already by the flag this is a Marine. So this is Robert Lewis Seapelt and his wife Teresa. Robert, born February 10, 1926, passed away on April 4, 2008. His wife, Teresa, March 16, 1931, and November 4, 2019. Let's see what rank he was. He was a corporal in the U.S. Marine Corps during World War II. Corporal Robert Sippel. Got a flag for him. Uh, I guess I'll put it here. I'll say simplify to Corporal Robert Seapel and rest in peace to his wife Teresa. Plus, give him a gem. One for Les Corporal Robert and his wife Teresa. Rest in peace and simplify. Zachary Charles Carter. June 19, 1997 to Feb December 31st, 1999. Picture him. This is Zach, our precious son. Another one, Mickey Mouse, I'll put it here. I'll say rest in peace to Zachary Charles Carter. Rest in peace. Robert Sabell, our dad, January 23rd, or 29th, 1959, to January 25th, 2017. He said he's gone fishing. Let's see if he has. Yes, he has. He's gone fishing. Now rest in peace to Robert. Rest in peace. Sharon L. Tucker. July 9, 1941 to September 18, 2006. She's got Yes, she does. Sharon L. Tucker. Rest in peace to Sharon. Rest in peace. Oh, Joseph Lee Brazier. May 31st, 1983 to April 19, 2003. Joey. Nice truck. The precious son, no farewell words were spoken, no time to say goodbye. You were gone before we knew it, only God knows why. I'm gonna leave a gem for him. Say rest in peace to Joseph or Joey. Rest in peace. Beloved son and brother, Elias Coy Kalor. 
June, June 13th, 2017, to unfortunately June, December 8th, 2017. Picture on the side, blank. Alright, we got a Mickey Mouse, Let's put it right here. Let's say rest in peace to little Elias. Rest in peace. Jerry L. Gerald. January 24th, 1956 to November 28th, 2012. Come back. We will always love you and miss you forever, friends forever. Randy, twin brother Terry, sister Bonnie, and Roseanne, brother Mike. Well, rest in peace to Jerry. Rest in peace. It says Sheila Dawn Higginson, I guess. Higgin Bottom, December 16, 1978 to April 29, 2011. That is a nice mural. I'll put this by the shell up here. I'll say rest in peace to Sheila. Rest in peace. This is Kyle James Bale, Bub. April 30th, 1987 to July 25th, 2018. Go Gators! For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son, that whoever believes in him shall not perish, but have everlasting life. And rest in peace to Kyle or Bub. Rest in peace. Love and memory of Stephen Michael Foster, October 27, 1967, September 19, 2017. Son, father, brother, and grandfather. Nope. Rest in peace to Stephen. Rest in peace. Son, brother, and a grandson, Johnny Lee Moore, November 3rd, 1991, to January 5th, 2007. Oh, oh, Looks like he's very well 16. Rest in peace to Johnny. Johnny Lee, rest in peace. So this is Natasha Marie Wilson, mommy and baby. Plus she had a baby named Kimberlyn Marie. So Natasha was born March 26, 1982 to August 30th, 2017. Her, her little one Kimber, August 30th, 2017. Same day she passed away. I'm well, something back to hit Oh, it's funny. Well, I got one for Natasha. I also have one for Kimberly, or Kimber. So rest in peace to both mommy and baby, Natasha and Kimberly. Rest in peace to both. Oh, Clarice T. Crawford, March 20th, 1992 to December 14th, 2011. Look at that headstone. Shape of a butterfly. There's probably something on the back, too. Oh. It says, Our time on earth is precious. We're only here a while. As I stare down at you, I do it with a smile. I smile because I know you have other places you could be, but still you took your time right now and spent it here with me. And as you walk away today, my family or my friend, know I'm missing you from up above until we meet again, time. Right, let's pick it right here. Oh. Let me put this right here below the butterfly. So rest in peace to Clarice. Rest in peace. This is Norma Jean Crawford. She was a sister, mother, grandmother, and a wife. Which her riding her bicycle. Uh, number one mother in the world. We love you, Mom. She was born April 20th, 1940. Passed away May 1st, 2012. And on the back, it says Mom's nine. Nine kids. Our family chain is broken, nothing seems the same, but as God calls us one by one, the chain will link again. Alright, rest in peace to Norma Jean. Rest in peace. Now this is Jackie Rose. Forever in our hearts, born February 15th, 1983 to March 22nd, 2019. Love and memory. No headstone yet. I should get one eventually. I'll put this right here. And I'll say rest in peace to Jackie Rose. Rest in peace. Gary L. Cooper, September 20, 1943 to October 6, 2015. Beloved father and grandfather and brother. And his collection. 
got a car and two bikes. Well, rest in peace to Gary. Rest in peace. Lance Corporal Michael Anthony Michelli, U.S. Marine Corps, August 31st, 1968 to November 17, 2014. There's probably nothing on the back of it. Nope. I got a flag for him, so I'll leave it right here. And I got a gem, put it up here. I'll say rest in peace to Lance Corporal Michael Anthony Michelli and Super Pie. Stephen Lawrence Nichols, September 7th, 1990 to October 11, 2013, beloved son, grandson, loving brother, and a nephew. A picture of it. Sitting on the back. Yeah, an eagle soaring, and even the youth shall faint and be weary, and the young men shall early fall. But that they wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with wings and eagles. They shall run and not be weary, and they shall walk and not faint. Isaiah. Well, that's a piece to Stephen. Rest in peace. Nicole Diane Aubrey, July 19, 1977 to August 12th, or August 7th, sorry, 2012. Picture over. Back. Big blink. I got Jim for her. I'll say rest in peace to Nicole Diane. Rest in peace. Lance Corporal William J. McCuffey. Vietnam, 1940, uh, January 17, 1947, April 20, 2013, Purple Heart. We got a flag right here. And got Jim. I'll say rest in peace to Williams. Lance Corporal William J. McCuffrey and rest and Semper Fi. Uh, Louis J. Bernelli, platoon sergeant, U.S. Marine Corps, World War II, September 8, 1916, to April 27, 1998. Flag for him and the gym. The rest of peace to Platoon Sergeant Louis J. Barnetti and Semper Fi. Orrin L. Maybury, August 28, 1976 to July 26, 2015. He was a hardcore ritual split. That's from the band. Put that underneath there. And also, rest of peace to Orrin. Rest in peace. Elmer and Elaine Brunk. Elmer born October 28, 1927, passed away on March 30, 2006. Elaine born October 7, 1927, passed away October 20, 2001. Both married June 21st, 1952. That lights up the night. I like it. But yeah, it lights up the night. That's cool. Well, this is for Elmer. And Elaine, rest in peace to both Elmer and Elaine Bronk. Rest in peace. This is U.S. Marine Anthony C. Tombish, May 22nd, 1960 to January 24th, 2023. That's him for it. And the flag. The rest in peace to Marine Anthony C. Tombish and Super Fi. Rest in peace. Ronald Calvin Taylor, April 17, 1962, December 16, 2020. Picture of him. Sitting on the back. Oh. So, loving wife Linda, December 5, 1998. Loving father of Kelsey, Kelsey Morgan. Sadie Irene, William Andrew. Loving Papa of Georgia Hope, Millie Jean, and Capri Scott. Put this up here. Say so rest in peace to Ronald. My condolences to all his family and his wife. Rest in peace. Ricky Lee Fulton Jr., August 5th, 1997 to May 18th, 2021. Loved by many, missed by all. Let's pick his beer back up for him. Uh, back. Oh, Paul. So where are my, you are my sunshine, my only sunshine. You make me happy when the skies are gray. You never know, dear, how much I love you. Please don't take my sunshine away. Love and miss you, mom and dad. Keep the party going until we get there. And rest in peace to Ricky Fulton Lee Jr. Rest in peace. Uh, beloved parents and grandparents, Hopper, JC and Shirley, JC born March 18, 1945 to March 8, 2004. Shirley, September 28, 1942 to July 13, 1999. Both married 
May 16th, 1964. Let's see what's on the back. I got one for JC and I got one for Shirley. So rest in peace to JC and Shirley Hopper. Rest in peace. Mark H. Hawkins, March 7, 1960 to December 7, 2005. Absent by present with the Lord. Picture of him. And an army vet. Specialist for US Army. Check on Specialist for Mark Harrison Hawkins. Well, rest in peace to Specialist Mark Hawkins. Put a flag here for him. And a jail. There we go. Rest in peace. Richard Vicky Rusher. Richard born February 15, 1947 to January 15, 2020. And his wife Vicky, May 6, 1953 to July 2nd, 2013. Richard. Corporal in U.S. Marine Corps during Vietnam. So with that, I will give him a flag. I'll say, simplify to Corporal Richard Rusher and we got Jim for him and his wife Vicky. So rest in peace to both Richard and Vicky Schur and simplify to Corporal Richard Rusher. Rest in peace. Jamie R. Gumbert, loving son of Larry and, and Gilbert, loving brother to Joshua and Jacob, December 1980s. December 7th, 1983 to March 29, 2007. Picture of it. But on back of it says, don't take this out. It says, our deepest sympathies for your loss from your family at A and W A and A Safety. Yeehaw. Now rest in peace to Jamie. My condolences to his family. Rest in peace. Ralph M. Adams or Ike, October 21st, 1929 to June 24th, 2020. Check the back of his headstone out. It says, everyone must believe in something. I believe I'll go canoeing. A rest in peace to Ralph or Ike. Keep canoeing, man. Rest in peace. Uh, Phyllis and Anthony Anelli. Phyllis born April 25th, 1942. Passed away on September 3rd, 2021. Her husband, Anthony, or girl by Tony, December 22nd, 1938 to August 21st, 2021. Says on Bayer, wow. It says Anelli with the American flag and an eagle. All right. Phyllis and Tony. Rest in peace to Phyllis and Tony Anelli. Rest in peace. Stephen Edward Sumner. October 7, 1968 to April 11, 2015. Loving son, brother, and a father. Melinda K., Amanda, Jordan, Mariah, Cameron, Dustin, Daniel, and Dalton. Okay, I'm back. It says, you and me going fishing in the dark. Lying on our backs and counting the stars where the cool grow grass grows down by the river in the full moonlight. We'll be falling in love in the middle of the night, just moving slow. Alright, rest in peace to Steven. Rest in peace. Connie didn't. Daddy D, December 3rd, 1931 to September 14th, 2018. Peace, loving husband, dad, and a papa. Married to his wife on November 14th, 1954. Back, a picture of his truck. Flatbed. And him, it looks like him on the seat. Alright, rest in peace to Connie D. Daddy D. Rest in peace. Catherine L. Whitaker. I called her Katie. She born December 14th, 1993 to March 12th, 2020. Loving Mama. Daughter, sister, girlfriend, granddaughter, niece, aunt, cousin, and friend. Oh, it says to many daughter, to my daughter, I am always with you. Be brave, have courage, and ride the breeze. Gone too soon, love and missed by 
family and friends. Uh, rest in peace to Catherine or Katie. Rest in peace. Landon Foster Eckers, July 29, 2002 to August 28, 2002. I think there's someone back. Yes, there is. The footprints. How very softly you tap, tiptoed into the world almost silently. Only a moment you stayed. But when an imprint, your footsteps left upon our hearts. Mommy, Daddy, Taylor, Colt. Alright, rest in peace to little Landon. My goes to the family. Rest in peace. Marine Sergeant Melvin J. Sweet Sr., U.S. Marine Corps, Korea, October 5th, 1933 to February 24th, 1999. Put it right here. And I'll put the gym right here. Oops, all right. and rest in peace and simplify the Sergeant Melvin Sweet Sr. Simplify and rest in peace. Lisa M. Foy. February 27, 1963 to October 18, 1995. With all my love. Good job. Good job. Right this one. Last point. Alright. Now rest in peace to Lisa. Rest in peace. Corporal Gene Samuel Anderson, U.S. Marine Corps, World War II. June 15, 1923 to November 11, 1993. The Purple Heart record. So I got a flag for him. I'll put it right here. And I got a blue gem. Put it right there. And so rest in peace to Corporal Gene Samuel Anderson. Simplify and rest in peace. Mark A. Masterson. Let's pick this up real quick. April 21st, 1958 to January 31st, 2007. Picture of What was anything on back to this? Nope. It's blank. I got a gold gym for him. I'll say rest in peace to Mark. Rest in peace. Paul A. Little, December 4th, 1964 to August 27th, 1985. To know him was to love him. Oops, oops. Back. Oh, it says Little, till we, sh till we shall meet and never part, sh sheltered and safe from sorrow. Jim up here. I say rest in peace to Paul. Rest in peace. Come to me, all of you who are tired from carrying your heavy loads, and I will give you rest. Zachary William Stoltz, February 20th, 1991 to August 19th, 2016. Love father, husband, son, brother, grandson, and a friend. He was a Marine, but he, he served in Afghanistan. It says back here. I love you, Daddy. I also have a flag for him. So put it right here. We got a gym. Well, rest in peace to Zachary William Schultz, Stoltz, a U.S. Marine. Simplify and rest in peace. Donnie Wayne Moore III, February 6, 1991, to August 28, 2015. Love son, father, and a brother. On the back. Blank. You got a watch that says dad. Some other things. So I'll give him a gym. And I'll say rest in peace to Donnie. Rest in peace. Joshua Dwayne Epperson, June 13, 1995 to May 28, 2007. Forever in our hearts, number 18. I'm take a test on. Yeah. With a broken chain, we literally knew that morning that God was going to call you home. Your name. In life we loved you dearly and death we do the same. It broke our hearts to lose you. You did not go alone. But part of us went with you today, God called you home. You left us peaceful memories. Your love is still our guide. And though we cannot see you, you are always at our side. Our family chain is broken and nothing seems the same. But as God calls us one by one, the chain will link again. Now rest in peace to Joshua. Rest in peace. Megan Ashley June Fabry. August 1st, 1993 to February 15, 2000, 
14. Loving daughter, sister, granddaughter, niece, cousin, and a friend. Let's look at this one. Back here it says, please don't cry one tear for me. Sometimes goodbye is a second chance. You know what? I'm going to put this gem right here. By the arm of the angel. So rest in peace to Megan. Rest in peace. Let's see. Russell and Hunt or Rusty. September 27, 1956 to April 29, 1989. There's a picture of you can see it. And a guitar. Back. Okay. So I'll put this up here. Say so rest in peace to Russell or Rusty. Rest in peace. Chris Sera Sera. Kathleen M. Hall. June 13, 1963 to June 27, 2007. Mother of Christina and Michael. Back. The Pitcher and Angels is loving wife of David, loving mother of Christina and Michael, loving daughter of George M. and Patrice A. Lovely sister of Mary Rose, Joseph, George, R, Patrice, H, Mark, Karen, Diane, Caroline, and Rebecca. Lovely friend of many. All right, rest in peace to Kathleen. And yes, K. Sarah, Sarah. Rest in peace. Gone home but not forgotten. Jean C. Lewis. February 16th, 1939 to May 2021. Lovely sister, mother, grandma, and granny. Song. Our sorrows disappear with the knowledge that you are with our Lord and Savior. There will be no more pain and no more suffering. Only peace and joy. We will be together again in glory. Right. This up here. Rest in peace to Gene. Rest in peace. John V. Lang Jr. September 28th or November 28th, 1972 September 19th, 1992. God, we're not forgotten. Sure not. So the U.S. Marine, the Lance Corporal. So it's Lance Corporal John V. Lang Jr. Well, I got a flag for him, so I'll put it here. I got Blue Jim. So rest in peace to Lance Corporal John V. Lang Jr. Semper Fi. Rest in peace. Uh, Sergeant Lawrence M. Martha. Is that how you say it? Martheller, I'll call him that. So Vietnam, September 21st, 27, 1947, April 8th, 2018. Got black one. And the gold. So, September 5, rest in peace to Sergeant Lawrence Mark, Mark Holland. Rest in peace. Alright, thanks for joining me today here at Pierce Township, Ohio, here at Pierce Cemetery. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you on the next video. Do take care of yourself, take care of your loved ones, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.